I was just talking to another maker, uh, an old friend of mine, and I was telling her about my last video where I had made price points for different products to make more money at markets, and I was just thinking to myself, how can you do this in a really easy way? Because sometimes, like in her instance, she is making like neck warmers and toques, and how much can you up level that product to make a more high end product? So a few ideas I had is you could get even more expensive wool, like if there's some real specialty wools, like some organic ones that are like maybe hand dyed with plant material or something like that. You could you could get that, but you would have to make sure that it aligns with your brand so that if you if you get something that's totally off the mark it won't really work so you have to kind of be careful with that but you could do something like really really expensive yarn a different style or the easiest way to do it other than creating a completely different product and sourcing new pr new materials and things like that which sometimes is tricky the fastest way to do it is just make a bundle so take a look at your what you have already, um, your existing products. This works really good if you have something that doesn't sell quite so quickly, not as successfully as you would like it to do. Create a bundle. So if you have like um, tea cozies that go around cups and a neck warmer and a toque, you could bundle it all together, put a really high price tag on it, and um, tie it up all together with string or something like that. So it looks really cute and label it like gift pack and then put your price tag on it and make it significantly higher than what you want to sell. So your $65 toques make it significantly higher price point. Yes, you have a few of them, two or three of them, so that if you sell some of them, that's great, it's awesome, but the purpose of it is to sell those, those $65 toques that you want to move. You want to move that stock, so that's what you do. So yeah, make a gift bundle up. See how that goes. I've got one in my shop for um, $350 and it's just literally just a bunch of Christmas candles and advent, advent calendar all mixed together. It's my like big luxury item and I just took what I had already in my stock and I just bundled it all together and said gift pack and that's my high price point. And have I sold any of them? No, but that's not the point of it point of it is to give people a reference point so that they can think that they're getting a deal and then they buy oh I, I love that oh I can't buy that but I'll buy this and it's selling the advent calendar on its own it's selling the Christmas candles on its own so it still has a purpose okay hope that helps see you later